Bal Bhatti is the brother of Shabazz Bhatti, who was the first Christian to serve as a minister for the government of Pakistan. Shabazz was gunned down by Islamic extremists on March 2nd for his stance against the country's blasphemy law and his support of Asya Bibi, the woman who has been sentenced to death for violating this law. His brother Paul says that his family has forgiven his brother's killers because forgiveness is what the Christian faith teaches, and he hopes that the life of Shabazz will be remembered for his work in promoting peace. He is not only a martyrdom for the Christianity, he is martyrdom for the humanity because he was uh, fighting for the basic human rights and he has been helping many non-Christian people also when they were in difficulty. So his message or his efforts was that for the persons who need peace. Paul Bhatti recently traveled to Rome to meet with different religious leaders and to remember the death of his brother. They discussed the best way to arrive at a peaceful solution over the blasphemy law and the best way to move forward in a country where tension over religion has often resulted in violence in the past. Yes, I do admit that unfortunately there are some people who are not Muslim, they do not represent Islam, and they are creating problems for the people and citizens of Pakistan and distorting the image of Pakistan in the world. I mean, changes don't come suddenly. An event like this does influence the course of events and uh, such a tragic incident that has struck the whole country. We, we've got to build on that. We've got to take it forward, really. I don't see the change coming by itself, and I don't see it coming so soon. Paul Bhatti and the Grand Imam from Lahore, Pakistan, met with Benedict XVI at the Vatican. Bhatti asked the Pope to continue supporting the Christians of Pakistan, saying that the biggest problem they face is a lack of religious freedom due to the blasphemy law. Bhatti was recently named as the chairman to Pakistan's All Minority Alliance and hopes to carry on his brother's work of fighting for the freedom of religion. His message or his efforts was that for the persons who need peace, who need their own right, who need their freedom, who need uh, freedom of expression in the society. So <clears throat> as the Christian community was more victimized of that, so he worked more for that reason. The assassination of Shabazz Bhatti has left a tragic mark on the people of Pakistan. It's a mark that the Bhatti family hopes will remind others of the message of peace between all people to which Shabazz committed his life.